Hello everybody, welcome to another video. On this video, we're going to be going over the advertising corner. Okay, so let's go ahead and click on it. And as you can see, right here in the advertising corner, we're going to be able to create cool flash animation graphics to introduce in our website. Okay, so as you can see, Website Expire already gives you a bunch of graphics for you to choose from. Okay, and down here, well, first let me go over the preview section. You see, when you roll over it, this Incomedia Website X5 uh, message pops out. Right here inside this circle, you're going to be able to input your own animation or your own image. I'm going to go over here and test this on my website so you can see what I'm talking about okay so you see when I roll over this and I put this image that says visit my web posting section and remember to subscribe okay you can go ahead and put an image right there whichever you want and over here you down here on the sound for page allows you to create a sound when somebody goes over this flash animation file so you can download the sound for your flash animation file over at my download section and below this video I will be leaving some links where you can go and learn how to create flash animations okay so the other thing that we have below the sound for page is we have page to link to once somebody clicks okay so you can this is optional so if you can choose one if you want to if you don't just leave it on the home page but I'm gonna show you you can only choose web web pages within your own website okay so it's not like on the other link in that you got to choose different options for where to link and stuff like that right here you can only choose links within your own website and I know that you might be thinking that that's a disadvantage but it's really not because if you're making a website for like an online store you can use these to promote new products or special offers that you might have maybe you you're making a, a website about a let's take for example a community you can put right here in the new stuff new updates that you have made to your website so that's a really good tool for you to use over here you have the width and height okay this is going to be established equally so if you choose 500 it's going to be 500 in width and 500 in height okay show on home page only you can choose for this to be shown on the home page only or to be shown on all the pages okay so now you can see that if I visit any page it's going to be Shown in every single page I have. Okay, so I'm pretty sure this tutorial was useful to you. I know that it was pretty easy to understand. I just didn't want anybody getting confused on this part. Okay, so below are some links where you can go ahead and learn flash animation. I hope you enjoyed this video. Go ahead and watch the other videos because we're going to be going over blog RSS feeds reserved areas okay and that is something that might confuse you and we're gonna explain it step by step so thank you for watching I'll see you on the next videos